Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to use VMware Workstation Unity Mode, and this also works for VMware Player, it has the same feature. So what that'll do is it'll allow you to run your virtual machine applications on your host computer, well even though it's not technically running them, you'll just be able to use them on your host computer. So it's probably easier to show you than try and explain it. Alright, so I have this Windows 10 VM, it's running Microsoft Edge with this great website open and Solitaire, and then on my host computer I have Chrome, Photoshop, you know, Windows Explorer, Notepad open, so four programs here and two programs here. So what I want to do is I want to use these two programs from my virtual machine on my host machine. So what you want to do is you either go to the view menu and Unity or click on the enter Unity mode here. And now you can see that the two programs from my VM now show in my taskbar down here and they have this yellow glowing bar around them showing that they're running on the VM not on my computer so you know so I could actually you know move stuff around and, and you know browse and do whatever I want and make them full screen and close them up if I want and so you might have noticed here there's press control shift U to launch new programs in this virtual machine. So if you, you can actually open additional programs without having to exit out of Unity mode, open the program, then go back into it. But this is very touchy and it does not work most of the time, at least of now. Hopefully they'll fix it by the time you're watching this video. Because if I press control shift U, nothing happens. But what I found is, let's say if I open one of my local programs here, and then press it, I usually have better luck. See, now that time it worked. And so now I have this Windows 10 Pro 2 menu. So that's a, this is the actual start menu from the virtual machine. You can actually exit Unity from here. You do use the run command and here's actual programs from the virtual machine. So if I opened up, let's say, calculator, this is the actual calculator running on the virtual machine, not my computer. You can see it's got that yellow glowing bar around it. So it's pretty cool. And then you could also, you know, browse the file system of the uh, virtual machine running out of room there. Close that out. And so when you're done, you just click on Exit Unity. It'll take you back in the virtual machine. Now you can see I got that Windows Explorer open. I got the calculator open. So it stayed open you know, even though I opened it while I was in my host computer here. Now there's a couple options you could do too from the uh, edit menu and preferences. There's a Unity section here. You could change the hotkey if you don't like the control shift U. And then you could uncheck this if you don't want it to minimize workstation when you open it. And then from the VM, there's some settings as well from the options tab and Unity. So if you wanted to show the borders and badges, and then you could also change that yellow to something else. And you want to have this checked for sure, otherwise you won't be able to get the uh, applications menu started there. So like I said, just uh, open it from here. And then it'll open all the programs you have open. And then you know, hopefully you won't have bad luck getting this uh, start menu to run here. And when you're done, just click ex exit, and then that's about it. All right, pretty simple. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.